Okay, here is our lesson on how to build your catapult. Now, before we start a few things, safety is important to us. So make sure that you follow the rules. Um, if we've told you to put safety goggles on as part of this activity, make sure they're on. And whatever you do, do not use anything for what it was not intended. Those rubber bands and that in the, in the packets are going to be very tempting, but I, they must stay with your group. If not, then you'll be um, removed and you won't be doing the experiment with us. You can do it in your own time. So make sure that you do safety first. Okay, let's get on with building our catapult. First of all, take five paddle pop sticks out of your bags and two rubber bands and join them together like this so that they are tightly bound at each end. Step two. Find the two tongue depressors in the kit and another rubber band. Join them at one, band, uh, one end like this. Three, you're going to use the paddle pop sticks and wedge it in between the tongue depressors like this, not to the point where it's going to break the tongue depressors, but so that there's a little bit of spring in this tongue, tongue depressor as you bend it back. Uh, and that becomes your fulcrum point. Number four, you need to join those guys together with another band. Now you're actually going to loop the rubber band under your um, paddle pop stick pile there, then over the tongue depressors, then under and then over and you do sort of a figure eight sort of thing there until they're nice and tightly bound together. Last but not least, you're going to join on your fork. Um, so take the fork and another rubber band and join it on with that rubber band all the way down the arm there so that it holds tightly and you can use that for your catapult. And that's the steps you need to follow for building your catapult. The next video will talk to you about how you're going to be testing that.